Hi, my name is Chance and welcome back to another episode of The Dirty Glass. And as you can see, I'm by myself again because someone decided to go out dress shopping. Because we have a Christmas party coming up and it's that time of year. So I'm alone, again, just with the three dogs that you might see anywhere in the background or down here, or up here uh, with me. So today, I actually uh, was a little bit more productive. I did some things in the garage, attached some new indicator lights to my classic car, um, which bring a picture right here. And it's a little warm out here in Arizona. So I figured, uh, you know what? I am want to try a whiskey or try whiskey again that I've had on our shelf for a while. And uh, it's actually pretty refreshing from what I remember. So I think it'll hit the spot. So today I'm going to be tasting for you guys Glacier 45 Mandarin Orange Bourbon. It's bourbon whiskey with natural flavoring um, of mandarins. Glacier 45 premium spirits are inspired by Oregon's active outdoor community and ultra pristine mountain landscapes. Our distillery, located in historic Baker City, Oregon, sits at the base of the Elkhorn Mountain and provides us with amazing amazingly clean and clear water from all of our spirits. We hope you visit our distillery soon, and if you can't, at least you can enjoy Oregon's finest in each sip of our handcrafted spirits. Glacier45.com, filtered and bottled by Glacier45 Distillery in Baker City, Oregon. Coming in at a whopping 45%, 90 proof. It's got a really cool label, uh, kind of artsy, and uh, you got a little orange mandarin thing in there. Um, and apparently they really love outdoors and things like that in Oregon. So that's why they did this. So let's just get right into it and see how it is. Oh, is it dud? Oh, it's also a synthetic cork. Uh, cork rating, one point, none. One point, one point one, one point two is what I'm gonna give it. I almost spilled all of the keyboard. Got some on my arm. Ooh, it's a nice fragrance. You guys should do some cologne. Ooh, that is orangey, mandarin y, and peely. It's um, not much of the much of the, not much of the pith. Of the pith. 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 Um, go and take a pith. The aroma is fantastic. It's actually, like a, a little bit of that. The same um, mandarin orange smell and like the chocolate oranges that come in a sphere and you break it and take a slice out and eat it. Not really a lot of bourbon smell on there. Just a lot of orange, a lot of mandarin, a lot of citrus zest. That's pretty much it. All right, down the hatch. All right, so it is very mandarin, very citrus. A little more peely, pithy flavor of an orange or a mandarin. It's, but you can tell it's bourbony. It's, it's really um, peely, orange peely. It is refreshing, but you don't, you get a little, I mean a hint, you can tell it's whiskey, but I wouldn't say bourbon, um, as far as like, you just tell it's, it's orange whiskey. It's just so orange mandarin right up front. Mandarin orange whiskey? You want some? No, no, you just want nuts. You just want nuts. Okay, good, okay. Get down, get down. Oh, it almost gets medicinal. Let's go ahead and try it with some water just to see what happens. Maybe it brings out a little more of those whiskey flavors. A little bit of water, nice twirl, or shake, whatever whatever your hand feels like doing apparently. Really torn, tones down the nose, that's for sure. Really tones it down. Doesn't make me want to go outdoors and do stuff though. Out, active outdoor community and ultra pristine mountain landscape. Doesn't remind me of any of that or of Oregon. It smells like lightly orange flavored whiskey. And there's like an undertone of what you can tell is like corn whiskey. Let's try it. That does get a little more whiskey. Actually, it's a little more, um, you can taste a little more of the vanilla sweet corn bourbon out of there. This doesn't have an age statement on it, so I'm guessing it's it's kind of a young distillate. Um, it tones the, the mandarin back quite a bit. I actually think I prefer it with water. I prefer it with water. It doesn't taste like you're just biting a mandarin um, orange peel with the plith, pith plith on there. It just it doesn't taste like that. I actually prefer it with water. Um, 
on the rocks neat, I think in a really hot summer's day, uh, would be absolutely fantastic. I think, I think it is a refreshing whiskey. It got a gold in the US Spirits 2020. It's a complicated orange whiskey if that's what you're looking for. I think this is right up your alley if you're looking for something refreshing, either in a cocktail or well, on the rocks. Uh, I think that this is good for that if that's what you're looking for. If not, I mean, I think it was like 45 bucks. Not bad, not great. Let us know what you think in the comments. And thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to give us a like, give us a subscribe. And until next time, taste away, you dirty glass.